Oh, that dog got legs. Ah. If it's up, then it's stuck. If it's up, clowns. If it fall down, just frown. Don't get mad at them. Let people rock on and be great. Hate is not the word. Don't people get on your nerves? If people rocking and rolling, let them go. Put your goddamn skates and skateboards on and everything else. And let them go. People get on my nerves. Every time I turn around, somebody will ask you and inquire about somebody else. Why? Well, they eating piss don't make you shit, right? When somebody asks me something about somebody else, I give them what the fuck they want. You want to know why? Because what the fuck are you going to do with the situation but go tell somebody else? You're going to go tell somebody else about what somebody else did, said, or uh, done. What the fuck do you care? I'm quite sure they don't care. Sometimes I hear rumors about myself and I still sit there and watch. And I just listen like, for real? Let me find out what the fuck else I did or said. People should stop that bullshit. People really should get a grip on that. I don't understand it. Everybody is fucking grown out in these streets. It's not worth it. Why don't you ask the people closest to you or ask that person? Why won't you? Because by the time it get down to A and Zinc, I done forgot about it. So don't ask me or call me and ask me about nobody else's business. I don't give a care. What they do is what they do. Let them be great. We only got one time here and time is what? Limited. It's not unlimited. It's not unlimited. Prioritize your own shit. Where about your own garden and backyard? Please. When it's up, it's up. That's their shit. Don't frown when it come down, clown. Cause you all in that. You all in that carrying somebody else's bag is like it's your luggage. Stop that bullshit. People doing them, don't ask me what somebody else is doing out in these streets cause I'm gonna give it to you. I'm gonna give you what you want and then I'm gonna go tell them some such and such is inquiring about you. So you ain't gotta figure out who you told something to and who it's gonna come back from. That's why you don't say nothing to people. You don't. People got shit going on and the kids getting motherfucking killed, missing, thugged out shit going on. That's what you worrying about? Somebody else shit. They steady climbing up the wall, minding their business. They ain't worrying about you. People need a lot of attention out in these streets. People need a lot of attention out in these streets and they ain't catching it. Put your skates on. Put your, get your skateboard. Skate on. Maybe you should ask some questions sometimes. Don't ask me. Because don't ask, don't tell. That's my policy. Don't ask, don't tell. Then I ain't got to worry about who the fuck I told something to. Or if I can't give you advice or offer you a ride if you need gas, food, something for the kids, clothing. I can even go to Goodwill and hook you up and get the pampers. Whatever the fuck you need to assist in your happiness or your, or your security or your stability. That's just how I roll. If he or she don't need this, that, and that to make sure they above water, I don't give a fuck about nothing else. As long as they safe and they not in unsafe territories. I don't care. I'm going to forget. Next time I hear about it, I'm going to motherfucking forget. So what is it to you? And what is you going to do with the information when you find out about them? Or are you going to try to help them? A whole dialogue of bullshit going on with people. That's why nobody can't get ahead. That's why everybody tear people down. People go through trials and tribulations in life. Ain't nothing perfect or nobody ain't happy right now. Stop asking me shit about people. It's already hot outside. I got bras and shit on my back. I don't need nothing else extra on my back. Like too much information sometimes overwhelm me. Too much information sometimes is overwhelming. Especially if it don't have nothing to do directly with me. I'm so transparent. I tell you. These teeth. These knees. Under my eye bangs and darkness. All that bullshit. I tell you I'm so transparent. Don't be mad when somebody give you what you want and then you don't like it. And you get you wanted to know, right? Daddy, the fuck you go. Now go figure, no, go back and run and tell that to your friends. When you they, some of your friends is closest to the people you want to know shit about, but you'll go to the other people so your friends won't be involved. So all you're gonna do is go burn them back and tell them anyway. That's why people be like, no new friends. I get it. It ain't no fucking friends. You gotta know the difference between a friend and an acquaintance. Confidant, co worker. It's a difference, man. It's a big difference. I'm just saying, even if it ain't your friend, co worker, confidant, be fucking, be, be, be graceful. Get a little sassy. Especially quiet people, they might speak, they keep going, you don't know much about them. People love to fuck around, fuck around how you get them itching. 
Then when they pop you, and then you got motherfuckers out here that like they never wrong or can't be told no different than what they think in their mind. Y'all be living shit in your mind about fucking people or hearing stuff about other people and taking it in the wrong run, run and run instead of dropping it and run from it. If it let it lay. If it fall, let it the fuck lay. If it don't got nothing to chew with you, let it go. If it don't apply, let it fly. What you gonna do with the information? I wait. We'll wait. Here the, the, the grass cutter, we'll wait. What you gonna do with it? But go create more hate. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I just had to get that out and let everybody know that the shit, we grown. The shit is too much. If somebody wanna let you know something that announce it to the motherfucking world. That's all I'm saying. Stop worrying about other people and get your own backyard together. You got to. You got to. Weeds is tall. The trees and the leaves is growing. You ain't break them the fuck up. Make your bed. Do something else to keep your mind going. That's like when people go to jail. Oh, they're going to get reformed when they come out. Yeah, they might be reformed when they come out. But did you reform your mind to be where they at when they came out? Your mind's still the same way when they went in. They might have got a little reform, got a little help. So now they out in the world trying to figure some shit out. When they back out in these streets, their feet is planted on brick. But now in your mind, you still all oh, day probably like an addict. An addict been an addict. Sometimes we got functional addicts. But we talking about the addicts that's not functional right now. As soon as they get clean, other people saying, oh, he be back hitting that pipe. Or she'll be back store and give her a week or two weeks. You have to have confidence if you got confidence in them. Some people have to be encouraged. If you're going to support them, support them. Don't support them on the side and tell everybody else what had happened and how you, what you did to help them. That's some bullshit there. People always want to know shit about people and keep gossip for what? I got so much shit going on in my mind. I done fucking forgot what I did 20 years ago. 20 hours ago sometimes. If it don't concern your pockets or your health or your family, let that shit fly. If you can't encourage them and be supportive, you'll feel good about yourself. Instead of being mean and nasty and bitter with nothing else going on but a bunch of fucking chaos. I don't care. Now, some stuff needs to be discussed. Some people need to be lit the fuck up. I tell my mom all the time, you got to get them from the gate. You got to get them from the gate that they know how to deal with you and then you now. Bottom line. But don't go around here and worry about somebody else's shit if it don't concern you or their safety. Don't do it. Just to go run and tell everybody to fuck up. By the time I get to A and Z, the story done got fucked up and chopped up. And you walking past the person every day. Hey, Sam. Hey, bro. Don't know shit. Wake and taking that shit home. I'm not carrying nobody uh, luggage and baggage. Or I'm going to go tell who. Sink the airport. We ain't about to drop it off and put it in the luggage claim. Everybody going to claim this motherfucking information that don't got nothing to do with them. Claim your ass. Keep your holes in your nose covered, y'all. I've been doing eight minutes. I ain't mean to go this long. But my policy is don't ask and don't tell. Don't ask and I won't tell. So let me give you what you want. And whoever you're inquiring about, they're going to know. So everybody on a straight path. That's it. Y'all keep covering y'all nose and y'all hoes and keeping y'all day clean. Y'all know what I mean? Keep your head on the swivel and keep your fucking mouth closed. When you in the front, stay, for, stay in the front. Fuck what was left behind. They'll catch up. Yeah.